y'all and welcome to my channel for those of you who are new uh, uh, am i gonna start my vlogs like that from now on i don't know there's people definitely outside of my window looking dead in here watching me talk to my camera but you know what i don't care because we're lit today guess what right now i am home alone i don't know if i'm the little i don't know if i'm focused right now so bear with me y'all i just got word that i'm going to new york tomorrow your girl is taking a whole flight to New York and y'all are coming with me. I know you're kind of salty that I didn't vlog in Florida and I kind of wish I already told y'all I was going to regret it as soon as I got home. Girl, why didn't you vlog? I'm vlogging New York. I'm for sure vlogging that. The whole plane excursion, I'm going with my boyfriend and his family. He's actually going to be in a wedding and I was invited. So we're going, we're leaving tomorrow at 3 p.m. I think is when our flight takes off. We are coming back here the morning of the 28th. So we're going to be there for a good minute. It. don't mind my hair i really don't know what i'm gonna do i think i'm gonna take a wig so i need to go to the store but everybody is gone to wait on my sister to get home from work me and my sister are currently sharing a car because she doesn't have a car my sister uses my car right now because she doesn't have a car currently and she needs to get to work she uses my car so i have to wait on her to get home but i need to make sure that i charge all of my batteries clear my sd cards i need to finish editing a video so that is ready to go up on sunday i also need to do some homework there's so much that i need to do but this is gonna be I think I'm gonna break it up into two different vlog vlog what two different vlogs so I'm gonna do like a prep with me and prepare because y'all my closet is crazy okay I started cleaning up when I got back from Florida and just never finished I really don't know what I'm wearing the only outfit that I really have planned is something to wear to the wedding it's a dress that I took to Florida that I never ended up wearing and my boyfriend really wanted me to wear it but I guess I saved it for good reason there's just so much going on through my head right now like I don't even know it's currently 3 55 so I have about 24 hours before we board our flights and get ready to go so I need to get everything together this is crazy so I wasn't planning on filming today which is the crazy thing I actually filmed a video yesterday of my current go-to everyday makeup routine today I actually just threw on some makeup and I actually really like the way that it came out it looks really natural and just cute very much so for the girls for this generation I may have to do a video on this look just need to put on something on my lips but y'all I'm weird I brush my teeth like twice I'll brush them when I get out the shower and then I'll brush them again right before I put on a lip product I like to exfoliate my lips yeah and I have a fear of having bad breath currently in my closet I want to show you guys a few things I want to do like a recent purchase video so I guess I'm just gonna do it with this I got two packages in the mail today my neighborhood is new they don't have mailboxes in here so we don't have like each individual mail boxes we actually have to like go and pick up the mail from the mailbox center so I have to go and get that my mom is the only one who has a key for it she's not home right now so I have to wait to get that but I do have a few things that I just recently picked up that I guess I will go ahead and show you starting with the two most exciting purchases I have hold up let me sit down get this together I think my lens is dirty too Sorry, y'all. Oh, wow. Okay. I feel like it is so dark, I, but I don't feel like bringing my ring light over here. Should we just go out here? Come here. I think that's better. Okay, I think this is better, but I can't really even tell. I hope it is. But hey y'all, can y'all tell like my energy, my adrenaline is pumped in. So I just got some new items that I want to go ahead and show you guys. I'm so excited about them. And yeah, start with the, my hair looks crazy y'all. Anyways, I bought some shoes. Y'all know I've been wanting to build up my Jordan collection since my boyfriend bought me some Jordans for Valentine's Day this year. He got me the Volt Gold ones. I'll pop them up on the screen. I have been obsessed with Jordans ever since. So I just recently bought two pairs. I got these off of StockX. These are just the Silver Toe. Jordans these are actually the women's version I feel like I have noticed the difference between the men's and the women's my volt gold ones are men these are the women's shoe and I feel like they're structured slightly weird it may just be because they're not laced yet I don't know they came with the silver laces I don't even know if they came with the black ones oh I'm joking they're actually already in the shoe such a beauty oh my gosh they have the little 
bag. They are so cute. I didn't even know that this was on here. Hold up. Not them being a little messed up. I can't wait to finally wear these. Y'all know I was talking about these in a recent haul because I bought a shirt specifically for them because I thought I would have been had these. I didn't. So I ended up just purchasing them myself. So happy with the purchase. I spent like $2.30 on them. Way more than retail. The retail for these shoes are $170. But that's what you get when people fell in love with Jordans just like me and everybody wants their hands on them. But I actually went to the mall. Jaden was in town. My friend Jaden, if y'all have watched any of my college vlogs, you probably know who I'm talking about. He doesn't live in Atlanta, but most of us do live up here. So he came up here to visit. We hung out for the day. We went to Six Flags one day, and then I hung out with just Jaden the other day, and we went to Lenox. I live in Atlanta, if you didn't know. I have never once stepped foot in Lenox. You know, he's never really been to Atlanta, so he wanted to go to Lenox too. So we just both decided to up and go. We did a little bit of shopping, so I'll show you some of those items. We went to Nike. This was actually the last store I think we went in. I just wasn't even expecting them to have any in there. Jordans, as soon as they're out, they go, especially if you're trying to get them for retail. We went in there to look. He found these shoes and they were so cute. And I was like, Jaden, if you want some, you better get them. They didn't have a price on them. So we're thinking, you know, even though Nike is the one who makes them, they were probably up charged like a lot because you can't get Jordan cheaper than like $200 nowadays. So we went in there thinking it was going to be about $200. I had already spent a little bit of money. So I wasn't even thinking about getting Jordans. I actually was going in there to get some Hirachis. All that to be said, we saw these shoes. I thought the color was so cute. I was looking at them too and he was like do you want them too and I was like mm, I don't know and he had already sent the man to go get his size by this point and when the man comes back he's like and you know what sorry can you get her a shoe too can you get her a size and I was like jaded you know what just bring me an eight and a half he went and got them I put them on my feet and I just couldn't say no then we looked at the box y'all we got them for 115 dollars yeah, mind you, I'm pretty sure these are the mids, but I think that they're super cute. They're not even, well, I guess there's a little bit. Why do they look the same? Y'all, I don't know much about shoes, so I can't even like talk. They have mids, which this says Jordan 1 mid, but they look like they're the same. Are these not literally the cutest thing? Let me, let me let these have their own moment. I am not joking. I got these for $115. $115. Can y'all see that? I literally fell in love. Like, I was already obsessed with this color, but when I put them on my feet, I was like, I can't say no. I called my boyfriend immediately, and he was like, those are hard. And I was like, I know. Like, I would literally be an idiot to not get them. I need to chill out, because I just put makeup on, and my hands are probably dirty. The mids, I think, go for cheaper anyway. We literally got matching shoes, and Jaden literally wore his out the store, because he said that he had been searching for some for so long, and he couldn't find any that he likes for under like $400. Like y'all would probably cuss me out if I would have passed up in that offer. Y'all know I cannot go to a mall without going into Bath and Body Works. A new one of my favorite fragrances. Literally can't get enough since my boyfriend got this for me for Christmas, I think two years ago. And I've been using it ever since. So I just picked up a new fragrance mist. Got this candle that literally smells so good. If you know anything about me, my favorite ice cream is mint chocolate chip and they had a mint chocolate chip milkshake candle. And it is so good. It's borderline like Play-Doh scented but like it smells so good. Oh my battery's dying. Okay, let me hurry up. Then I actually didn't purchase these but my sister gave them to me. So this is a scent called Sun Washed Citrus from Bath and Body Works. It's a mini candle and it smells so good. It just reminds me of like summer and spring and just freshness. The matching hand cream for it and the hand sanitizer with the little, what's it called, pocket back. There's a thousand wishes hand cream. That's all I got from Bath and Body Works. So I went into Morphe. So I just picked up a few things. Their foundation. I've been wanting to try this for so long and then I've I've never owned a lip liner, so I just paste one up in, uh, Oh my gosh. Date Night is the shade and it's just a dark chocolatey brown. That's like the only thing I line my lips with. Two lipsticks. This is in Kissy Face and First Base. And then Morphe and James Charles and all that. I'm not even going to talk about that. Their stuff was on sale so I just picked up the brush kit. I mean it was pretty expensive because it's on sale and you get a lot of good brushes. I was in the hunt for some brushes anyways. So and then since I spent so much I actually got a free sponge and I've never tried Morphe sponges. I don't I think I got a free microfiber sponge and I love the color. I actually got this yesterday. I just went to the store. I needed to get some new hangers because I'm running out of hangers in my closet. So I just picked up some more. This is just a 25 pack and I hope it's enough because I have so many things that I need to hang up. They were only $10. So, and then last but not least, I got something that I'm so excited about. I got this chair. Is this not literally the sexiest thing? So before at my vanity over there, I just had this stool, but since I got a whole vanity set, 
setup this just wasn't doing it anymore and it's actually kind of too tall this was the perfect thing y'all see that $60 only $60 at Ross I've been looking for some chairs to replace this stool in there for a minute they were like no less than a hundred dollars and when I saw this one I was like I have to get it it was like a, a good thing too because y'all know I'm nervous about driving that was the first time I have driven by myself at this point but yesterday was the first time like I went and I wasn't just going to someone's house like I drove and went to the store park went in and did stuff and to y'all y'all probably like mm, that's not that much but me with having anxiety and then finally getting over like my biggest fear which was driving it was like really exciting for me I've been looking for this chair or a chair like this for a minute it's really cute you know it was just like a you know sometimes you have to treat yourself okay so I just picked that up but I'm gonna change out my battery I'm gonna get my life together okay figure out what I'm gonna do and then I will come back to you guys maybe when I'm going to the store and then we will be good to go so I will come back to you guys when I am ready to update you hubby ring are you outside oh that's Kristen why is she here why is my sister here wow she just got here oh. Angel plans, guys, we are going to the store now. So, I low-key need to go get my toes done. Oh my gosh, it's hot. to figure out somewhere to put my camera. We, a we, we, we need to go to a gas station. My camera. She ain't put no gas. No, she was sick. Yeah, they sent her home. Hey, yo, can you wait your turn? I think I'm gonna just go to the racetrack. Wait, I don't even know which side the gassing is on. Stop, now go. Drop it fast and move it real slow. Oh, the camera. Uh, I'm gonna have to order a tripod because this ain't gonna work. All right, y'all. So I actually just got into the Walmart parking lot. I'm about to go in really fast. I just put gas in my car and I filled it up. So you're welcome, Kristen, my sister. Um, But it is so hot in this car. I have no AC still. If you know, you know. I'm about to go in. I'm kind of nervous because I've never vlogged in public by myself and I'm about to do it. So wish me luck, y'all. At least I'm gonna carry the camera in there. We'll see if I actually vlog. Headbands, I'm talking about, so I may just go with these. Hopefully, that work. This one will match my dress. I may still go to the used by store though, just to see, but I think those will work. I think that's all I need. I need to find some shoes. Maybe I'll get some from here. mission complete but i spent 55 dollars on what i don't even know like what did i get i don't remember it is hot though i need to hold up um let down these clucking windows i got a drink i've never had this before i don't think very limited i don't know if i'm just hot and thirsty or if this is really busting but it's really busting. I need to find a beauty supply store. I know that there's one in this area, I believe. Okay, it is so hot. Oh, he just called me. You look hot. I'm hot. Both. You said what? Hey, you look hot both ways. Thank you. And yes, I'm burning up. I feel so grown driving around and going in this store by myself, putting gas in that core. Head northeast, then turn left on. Which way does this one go? Dang, lady, you could have let me out then. Oh, uh, the camera's not going to work, so I'm going to have to put y'all down, and I'll update y'all when I get to the beauty supply floor. All right, y'all. Having this window down, first of all, is messing up my head. It's messing up the flow, but I just made it. I'm trying to figure out where the light is. Just made it to the beauty supply store. It was literally, like, right across the street, so I'm about to go in. I'm going in there for one thing, to get a headband, and that's it. So, hopefully, I don't spend any more money than that. Like I said, I did find one in Walmart, but I'm pretty sure I could find one better in here, and I just 
just wanted to have that one for backup. I'm gonna go in here and see. Ooh, blended smoothie and juice bar. I'm gonna go in there and see what they have. I feel so like adulting. That's not a word, but this is a lot. This is really a lot right now. Potential thumbnail. Hi. Um, do you have headbands? Yes, I do. <laughs> K or Shay. Okay, thank you. I'm sorry. K A Y Y R A C H E apostrophe. Thank you. You too. What'd you say? I look good. Thank you. I need it for the trip. And where are you going? Summer breeze or island splash? Babe, which one should I get? No. <laughs> okay. It's actually really cute in here. The large is seven dollars. Should I get a large? <laughs> all right y'all so i actually just got back in the car sorry this is probably annoying that the steering wheel is over my mouth but i got the smoothies i don't know if they're having a little redneck hangout but <laughs> i need them to move away from my car but i got two smoothies one for me and one for my boyfriend so right now i'm about to head back to the house because i need to drop something off to my sister and then i'm going to head to my boyfriend's house and to go from there, I may not vlog at my boyfriend's house though. Maybe like a little bit. Just because this is supposed to be like a prepare to travel vlog. And you know, Did you say you your toes done? I was going to, but I'll just paint on myself. I don't feel like going to a nail salon right now. Okay, I don't know which one is which. Okay, she's cute. Let me see. Mm, she needs a little. She needs a little more work, but it's not terrible. Okay, we see her. I guess I'll just go back that way. So the camera's gonna fall. I already know it. So I'm about to turn it off and then I'm gonna head home, go take that. Maybe I'll update y'all in between then. I don't know, probably not. And then get to my boyfriend's house. So I'll see y'all in a minute. Oh, I just got to the hubby's house. I just have to finish all the song. So I'm about to go in. I'm pretty sure he's... Okay. I'm pretty sure maybe I shouldn't eat. I'm pretty sure he is mowing the lawn right now So I'm just about to go in and chill. I brought him a snack and Okay, it doesn't even want to turn off but I'm about to go in and chill. I brought him some snacks Y'all saw I went to the smoothie bar. I went home dropped off the stuff came here Well, I stopped at the gas station because I wanted some key lime Kit Kats because those are so bomb and he likes them too And then I also just grabbed him some candy I don't know if he's gonna eat it. I just grabbed it because I felt bad if I just got myself some and not him mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Too much stuff. Not enough pants. We have made it in. I might go back there and mess with him. See where he is. Oh, I don't want to step in the grass. I have on Air Forces. Look at my sexy man. So he's mowing the grass. I'm about to sit in here and chill, make myself real nice and comfortable. Yeah, I'm about to chill, drink my smoothie, and wait on him to come in. So I'll update y'all later, maybe when I'm on the way home, something like that. So, all right, you guys, so I'm about to leave my boyfriend's house. He actually has to go somewhere, so we're just gonna head out together. But I'm waiting on him so we can go and I can head home because I need to pack, I need to shave, I need this, that, and the third. So I need to get myself together. We're not leaving until, like I probably don't need to be ready tomorrow until like 12 or one. It's like 10 now. So I just want to get as much done and out of the way before I go to sleep as possible. So don't have to worry about it tomorrow. Oh my gosh, and he has to pee. Takes three seconds, shut up. My pants keep falling. Does that mean I'm getting skinny? Am I getting skinny? Yeah, I'm waiting on him. I, I don't even know, like, what I'm, I don't even, like, the thought of what I'm gonna take to wear. Like, I don't, I don't, I, I can't. To get the soup. Oh my, my battery's dying. They spell my name wrong. Everyone spells your name wrong. No, my last name. Oh. They put M-A-R-I-E. What? Gotta go get it, I gotta go get it, I gotta go get it, I gotta go get it. I be forgetting I can start my car from outside of the car. You know what, I'm gonna just get in the car. Bye, baby. I love you. You're not gonna close my door? Extra cute. <laughs> I hate my boyfriend, but I love him at the same time. It's made to uh -huh. turn it down, shoddy love. Oh, I gotta turn my music on. He's gonna have to wait. Sure, I'll listen to this. Okay, wait, let me turn the camera off. I'll update y'all when I get home. All right, y'all, I made it home. This battery's actually dying, so I'm not gonna stay on this clip for long. Um, I do have another battery, but I'm just gonna. 
you know i got the suitcase i'm really just going to come in here and finish cleaning up my closet like i was doing before i left i kind of up and left without really planning on leaving i was like hanging stuff up and all that so i'm gonna finish cleaning up my closet and then plan what i'm gonna take from there because i really don't know at all what i'm gonna take besides the dress i'm taking to the wedding and then i also need to shower and shave and do all of that yeah i just have a lot to do so the next time i'll update you guys will probably be when i'm actually putting everything in my suitcase i'm not sure for now i'm going to just clean up my closet and then i'll come back to you guys soon hopefully when i'm like kind of all together because i look a mess my skin is oily let's not talk about it but i will see y'all in a minute All right, y'all, so packing for this trip is really wearing me out. I don't know, like, my thoughts about the trip. I'm so excited to go, don't get me wrong, but as of now, like, my thoughts about the trip have just, like, slowly gone down because I've realized how, like, unprepared I am. I didn't know, like, what outfits I was gonna wear. I didn't know anything I was gonna pack. I haven't flown in a long time, so I don't even know all the regulations. I remember that the last time I flew, I was in ninth grade, and I'm currently a sophomore in college. I just, you know, I had to get everything to together and i'm just realizing like i'm ripping and running i have to go back to the store tomorrow because i forgot some stuff my boyfriend has to put some stuff in my bag i have to think about how i'm taking my laptop and my camera charge all my batteries empty off my sd cards i need to edit some i just have a good bit to do and i didn't realize how little time 24 hours is to prepare for a trip at least for me anyways all to be said i'm really just about to take off all my makeup right now with the little makeup wipe because it's well overdue first of all and i'm gonna get in the bed and i'm gonna try and just get up early in the morning it's currently 12 43 already but i'm gonna just try and get up earlier in the morning i'm gonna shower everything is packed for the most part in my suitcase i'm gonna do that yeah but i'm i'm just tired and ready to go to sleep so i'm just gonna wake up early in the morning with a new mindset and everything like that and i'll probably come back and end out this vlog when i'm in a bit higher spirits tomorrow and then start the actual travel vlog yeah i'm really excited to go but i'm just ready to be done with the packing and the pre stuff i'm about to go grab a makeup wipe i know they're bad for you but that's just the kind of night i'm having i'm gonna go wipe off my makeup and get ready for bed talk to my boyfriend a little bit encourage him while he has a bit of homework to do and call it a night so i love y'all so much and i will see you guys in the morning when i am better prepared Ooh. We gonna have to close this. Mm -mm. Good morning, guys. It is travel day, which means that it is crunch time. Okay, I'm up and at them a little bit early today. It is currently 8:47. I've been up since probably about six ish i woke up like when my mom was getting ready for work and just couldn't go back to sleep which is usually how it is on days when i'm traveling or doing something exciting i usually can't sleep so i mean i went to sleep and slept good last night but i just woke up pretty early this morning like naturally i've just been up and moving i got up i neared my leg once again i didn't feel like shaving so i did that i also painted my toes i was gonna go and get my toes done yesterday but i just did not feel like sitting in a chair and waiting i just ended up doing them myself and I just painted them I did them a little messy though and I thought we had some nail polish remover and I don't think that we do so I'm gonna go to the store I was gonna go to the store anyways and I'm going to pick up some stuff but also this morning I've showered I'm about to go and brush my teeth but I'm gonna just do my hair a bit right now I need to check to see when does rainbow open it's like right next to the Walmart that I'm about to go to so I'm just going to check okay they don't open until 11 I could go to Ross. Well, these shoes are cute. Don't tell me I gotta buy some more shoes, some more Jordans. Ross is open, so they opened at 8. I guess I'm going to Ross right now. I just need to, like I said, just do something with my hair. I guess I'm gonna just straighten these front pieces. I'm gonna straighten these front two pieces and then brush the rest of my hair up and out of the way. Right now, I'm also on the way out. I'm going to stop by the mailbox and get those packages that I was waiting to get yesterday. Pretty much preparing. I like to just get stuff done out of the way early, personally, as soon as possible yeah i'm not really in a rush as of now because probably don't need to start heading to the airport until like one i still have a good bit of time like barely even nine o'clock now i may just leave the ponytail out it's kind of messy but kind of fits the fits the description right now so just don't judge my hair right now i'm just straightening it to be decent i'm going to pop in some earrings as well grab it with my nail 
and I dropped it. So I dropped the bag. Of course I have fluffy white shaggy rug underneath my vanity, which is where I'm sitting at right now. That's like long gone. You're joking. Okay, both bags are on. Hair is looking somewhat decent. So I'm about to go and brush my teeth. I will probably catch you guys in the car. I'm about to head out. I will update you guys when I get in the car. So I'll see y'all in a minute. Here's the airport fit. You know, some of y'all are probably gonna be like, girl, it's hot outside. I know it is. You live in Atlanta. Yeah, it is. But this is gonna keep me comfortable on the plane, in the airport, all that. So yeah. Okay. All right, y'all. So my sister, well, somebody had to move my brother's car. So my sister is moving it right now because he parked behind me. And for some reason, he don't trust me to drive. So he won't let me drive his car. Um, Not even to move it out of the driveway. <laughs> two feet right not even out of the driveway just move it over so i can leave but i'm about to head out thank you you're doing great sweetie okay i'm about to head out hopefully my camera does not fall i don't even know if i'm in focus i know it's probably annoying that it's crooked look before you turn kiddos but I'm about to head to this mailbox. I've never even been. Hopefully the mailbox numbers are literally just the house number because I don't know anything. I don't even remember where it is exactly. So we'll see how this goes. Okay. Oh, I know it's at the front of the neighborhood. Obviously, duh. <laughs> I don't know where. I hate that we have speed bumps in our neighborhood though. I mean, it's, it makes sense because we're like on a hill. Okay, it's not over there. Oh wait, shit, it is over there. Fuck. Do not vlog and drive kids, especially if you're a new driver like me. I swear these birds be having a death wish because they just be flying out right in front of a car. Not like up high either, but like down low. Pull over here and park. I'm gonna just leave y'all in the car. The mailbox is literally right here. All right, y'all, so I can't figure out how to open it. <laughs> you think it's easy because you just put the key in the thing and turn it, but it's not working. My SD card is full. In my camera, so I'm just gonna vlog on my phone. I don't feel like going all the way back to the house. I'm ready to go to the store and come back. I really wanted to get my stuff out of the mailbox, but I literally can't. I can't for the life of me. I literally for the life of me cannot figure out how to open it. So I'm about to go, and I guess I'll just try it again when I come back. Dang, I really thought that was gonna stay up there. Don't get it twisted, y'all. I really do not know how to drive, but I do at the same time. But yeah, so I guess I'll just try and stop again later still recording if that does anything i'm about to just go to the store i'll update y'all when i get there since i can't figure out how to get anything to stay up i'm definitely ordering on amazon a tripod as soon as i get back home um as for now can't figure it out so i'll update y'all when i get to the store i'll see y'all then all right y'all so i just got to walmart i'm about to walk in i feel so like old school me don't tell me my phone is out of storage too so you lied to me no, I went to Ross right down the street. I went to get some sandals and then I came home. And guess what? You're still not here. So guys, I am back home now. My phone ended up running out of storage too. So I had to wait until I got home to vlog. But right now my boyfriend is apparently outside. Apparently. So he's coming to come get me, but I need to do a few more things. I need to put my shower gel into a bottle. Put these shoes in my suitcase. Hopefully they fit. I didn't even try them on. I went to Ross and grabbed some more sandals. Ziploc bags, another travel size container. I got this cute toothbrush. It's Shopkins. Isn't that so cute? I don't know why it's so dark. It's so cute. Then I got a berry lemonade because these are fire. What? Wow. Get out. Really? Get out. Anyway, so I'm about to load everything into my suitcase and then I will update you guys later because apparently my boyfriend is rushing me. Just come inside right quick. The last of this bottle, anyways. You spitty. Look at my cute toothbrush. So cute. I need my phone cord. Oh, my camera's still on. I look like that? No way. I look Sometimes dead inside. It's gonna be worse. What? Yes. Guys, we're heading out. Everything is loaded into the car. Well, my stuff. Now we're headed to his house so we can get all his stuff. And are we taking your mom's car to the airport? We're gonna switch cars, we'll load up the car, and head to the airport and get ready to go. You feel me? I'm excited. Babe, I dropped two earring backs this morning when I was trying to put my earrings in. I dropped one. And I lost it in my rug. But yeah, we're headed there. I guess I'll update you guys once we get there or when we're doing something interesting. 
but yeah so i will update you guys when we're doing something interesting all right guys so we actually made it to this place but then we chilled out for a little bit and he wants to go to the mall we're about to go to the mall i'm hungry so we need to stop why do i feel like i'm moving so slow like i need to figure out my settings because i feel like i'll be like lagging low-key i don't want something to eat But turns out our flight actually doesn't leave until six. We're leaving the house at three. This whole time I thought the plane left at three, but we're leaving the house at three so we can make it there. But guess I heard that incorrectly. Off we go to the mall. To the mall. Is it gonna fall? Oh, it might not. They have pulled out their Glock. Yeah, I'll see y'all in a minute. Say bye, babe. Say bye. Bye, y'all. Crazy. All right, y'all. So we're back at my boyfriend's place. I didn't vlog in the mall. Honestly, I kind of, I just wasn't paying attention to it. It was really just like a one and done thing. Like he went to get some shorts. So he went straight into H&M, found some shorts. And then we went to like two other stores, maybe got some food and then headed back here because we have to be ready to leave by three and it's 2.54 right now. We probably won't leave at three. He still has to eat. I just finished eating and I still have so much food on my plate. It almost looks like I didn't touch it. I don't care what anybody says, mall Chinese hits different. And that's just the truth. Yeah, so we're getting ready and I don't know, I may close out this vlog here and then start another one when we're like in the airport, but I'm not sure. You'll see if it cuts off or if it keeps going. But yeah, why are you sagging so low? I'm in my house. Let me do what I want to do in my house. Yeah, I'm about to go off camera and wait on him to finish and get ready to go. I'll update you guys later, I guess. Ew, I like... <gasps> Maybe I'll be looking a little more presentable in this because this ain't working for me no more. I'll update you guys a little later when we're on the plane, something like that, and headed to New York. 